Can God, uh, question 27, can God use a person who's in sin? Uh, this is a, a video on the playlist of 50 hot potato questions uh, for Christians. So can God use a person who's in sin? Uh, I can answer that question uh, based on uh, my life uh, and uh, uh, addictive uh, sin life that I've had and God has uh, been using me uh, in the last 10 years uh, to write uh, many Christian books and uh, he has uh, used me uh, to prophesy over individuals' lives and uh, God has certainly uh, been using me. Um, we hear accounts of uh, people who've uh, been uh, caught in adultery or caught embezzling money or caught uh, in any number of uh, uh, different uh, situations. And up until uh, the day they were caught and exposed, uh, God was using them. Um, we have an understanding of uh, people in the Bible, uh, sinful people. Um, we have uh, the account of uh, the Apostle Paul uh, who uh, was killing Christians and uh, and uh, putting uh, Christians to death. Uh, he was arrested and uh, by uh, God uh, and uh, thrown off his horse by Jesus and, and then used... He didn't uh, continue in sin and uh, the Bible uh, exhorts us and encourages us uh, to live a life uh, free of sin. Uh, but God can uh, use sinners. He can use uh, people who are, are caught in sin and uh, are living a life uh, that uh, involves sin and uh I suppose uh, that uh, is a very good thing uh, for Jesus uh, to be able to uh, use people who aren't whole, uh, to use people who are broken, uh, to uh, help and encourage other people uh, that are broken. Um, I'm uh, only... Uh, encouraged and, and blessed uh, that Jesus has uh, seen fit uh, to use me uh, to to write uh, 86 books and uh, he's uh, used uh, my books uh, to encourage uh, thousands of people and uh, um, I've uh, been a person who has uh, contributed uh, much uh, sin uh, in my life and uh, and been responsible uh, for uh, quite a lot of sin and uh, God has uh, seen fit uh, to use me and uh, I believe uh, that uh, there's many people uh, who uh, have an addiction uh, to pornography or an addiction to prostitutes uh, that um, are currently uh, being used by God in other ways and in other areas. Um, uh, we live and serve a God of uh, grace and a God of mercy, and uh, he sees fit uh, to use uh, broken uh, individuals uh, like myself um, and uh, there's a certain joy uh, that can be found in uh, ministering and uh, being used uh, in ministry um, and uh, some people uh, would uh, uh, say that uh, if uh, you've uh, got sin in your life uh, you shouldn't uh, be ministering um, and uh, you shouldn't uh, be uh, doing uh, personal prophecy over people. Um, but uh, God has uh, seen fit uh, for me uh, to be used in that way and uh, he's uh, seen fit uh, for me uh, to 
uh, write uh, Christian uh, non-fiction uh, books uh, to encourage people and uh, bless people. And uh, I uh, believe uh, it uh, has given me uh, something to live for and uh, something uh, to feel a purpose uh, in my life. And uh, God has been uh, by my side and uh, encouraging me and blessing me uh, throughout the journey. Um, so I uh, pray uh, that uh, this video has encouraged you. And if uh, you're living uh, with uh, things in your life that are sinful, I hope uh, that uh, this video has uh, been used to encourage you.